Hello, my name is Michael Greer, Executive Director here at Portland Ballet. We'd like to take this opportunity to introduce you to some of our dancers and give you an inside look into some of the people that make up Portland Ballet. Welcome. Thanks. Um, can you introduce yourself and tell us how long you've been here at Portland Ballet? Sure. Um, I'm Caitlin Hayes, um, and I've, this is my fourth season with Portland Ballet. Great. And what, what brought you to Portland Ballet? Um, well, I had a friend from college that was in the company, and I was in the process of auditioning. I was living in Boston for a year, um, and I contacted her, asked her what it was like up here. She said she loved it. Um, and I've been coming to Maine since I was a kid because we are a big skiing family. So I came up here and auditioned um, and I loved the atmosphere. Um, everyone was amazing in the class, treated me great. Um, and then uh, Nell asked me if I wanted to sit and watch and some of rehearsal, they were doing Armed Man. And just watching, they had done the first half of it and completed it and it was just like, I want to be here. This is exactly the reason why I want to come up here. It was everything that I wanted. Um, and then I got the job, so I moved up here. Excellent, excellent. And what is your favorite thing about the city of Portland? Um, I guess my favorite thing, I'm not, I have a lot of anxiety as a person. <laughs> um, so being in a really big bustling city, I get very anxious. I can't handle it. So it's the idea of it's a city, but it's not a huge city. So I've, it's a little bit calmer. I feel like um, I have the idea of a city, but I'm not like trying to get from point A to point B as fast as I can with 15,000 people around me. It's a little bit calmer, a little bit um, more subdued, I guess you could say. Um, yeah, I feel much safer here than anywhere else. So Wonderful. Thanks, Kaylin. Thank you. Great. Welcome. Uh, can you introduce yourself and tell us uh, how long you've been here at Portland Ballet? Sure. Um, I'm Eliana Trenum. Uh, this is my fourth season. Um, so I've been about three years, but <laughs> start, starting the fourth. Um, came as an apprentice, and uh, it's my third year as a company member. Excellent. Excellent. And what brought you to Portland Ballet? Um, well, I've done, done some auditions around um, Portland. Uh, just a really nice city. It's uh, very cosmopolitan for its size. Um, it's next to the ocean, um, and it uh, has has a lot of sophistication. There's a great food scene. I also work in um, the food industry, so I just had a lot of appeal. And you know. what's your what's your favorite thing about about the city of Portland? Um, well, um, <laughs> first of all, with my opportunity to. Uh, Dance with Portland Ballet that has um, it offers a lot of versatility in terms of the rep that we do, um, and being a small company, I get to be on stage uh, more frequently than I would in a larger one, which is lovely. Um, and uh, as for Portland itself, I think um, just the the energy and the creativity of um, its restaurant scene. Um, there's a lot more freedom for uh, young chefs uh, than there is in some other large cities uh, where you have to be more established. So. Um, and, and the people are lovely here as well. <laughs> so. Wonderful. Thank you, Eliana. You're welcome. <laughs> welcome. Uh, can you introduce yourself and tell us how, how long you've been here at Portland Ballet? Uh, I'm Jennifer Jones, and I am in my seventh season with Portland Ballet. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. What brought you to, to Portland Ballet? The people running it. Uh, when I came to audition, it was Jeannie O'Brien and Nell Shipman. Uh, Jeannie, the founder, is this incredible woman. She has this nurturing, lovely soul and a deep, deep respect, admiration, passion for the art form and the artists. And she just managed to infuse the whole organization with it. And it's still here. It's in the walls, you know. And Nell, <laughs> she taught my audition. And after the audition, I just I called my parents and I said, I need to work with her. She's so talented, and I've been around the block. Uh, she's world class, I think, as a choreographer, as a teacher, as a coach, as a person. So talented and also very nurturing. She manages to find a balance between, she has this great rapport with her dancers, with us, and she respects us, and she has fun with us, she appreciates us, but at the same time, there's no question of who's in charge. She is unquestionably leading that room, which is really hard to find. Excellent, excellent. Thanks, Jen. Uh, and, you know, what is your favorite thing about the city of Portland itself? Portland 
I love that it's, it's a little city with the soul of a little fishing village. You know, you have all of the culture, you have the PSO and Portland Stage, Portland Ballet, the museums, the restaurants, but it's the kindest city I've ever lived in. It's like the perfect man. <laughs> you know, it's, he's good looking, he's sophisticated, he's cultured, but he's also really sweet. It's the man that you can't wait to introduce your parents to. That's Portland. <laughs> Wonderful. Thanks, <laughs> Jess. It was great. All right. Welcome. Uh, can you introduce yourself and tell us how long you've been here at Portland Ballet? Um, I'm Savannah Lee, and I've been with Portland Ballet maybe two weeks now. It's my <laughs> debut season. So. Fantastic. Yeah. And what brought you to, to Portland Ballet? Um, I really wanted stability because I was freelancing in New York City and um, it's really tough and takes a lot of diligence to you know, come up with the money and take open classes and then go and find your work and everything. And this seemed like a very stable environment where everyone supports each other and you can grow and perform together and it's consistent, which is great. Um, so, yeah. Wonderful, wonderful. And so far, what is your favorite thing about the city of Portland itself? Beer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, I haven't gotten um, much time to explore yet, but you know, I can breathe here. It's not very much pollution. I practically moved on top of a brewery. Um, yeah, it's just been a really nice change, and I really needed it. So. Excellent. Yeah. Thank you, Svetlana. Yeah.